When Kevin Macbeth took over as director of the St. Louis Symphony in Unison Chorus in January 2011, he had just a few weeks before the chorus would perform its annual Lift Every Voice concert. He worked quickly to develop a strong rapport with the chorus and orchestra. Ten years later, those relationships have flourished as the SLSO celebrates Kevin's first decade as in unison chorus director. Being welcomed into the, into the community is uh, uh, is essential. It's key, and so uh, I have worked uh, over these last ten years to, for instance, to build trust within the community. And and uh, I always have the the scope and the vision of the ensemble at heart. In the past ten years. Kevin has led the In Unison Chorus in annual Gospel Christmas and Lift Every Voice celebrating Black History Month concerts, as well as yearly community choral concerts. But his work touches every part of the SLSO. Uh, getting a chance to, um, uh, to work with the orchestra um, uh, apart from the chorus and, and to build that relationship has, has been tremendous for me. That feeling of family extends to the audiences who watch Kevin lead performances, said longtime in unison chorus member Will Atrell Rice. I believe Kevin even helps the audience to be comfortable. I mean, he turns around, he talks with them, he engages them. Soprano Jennifer Kelly said Kevin excels at meeting each member of his musical family where they are. Learning from Kevin was very easy. Uh, he has a way of you making you feel comfortable with uh, your sound, your abilities, no matter what you know level um, you're at. He kind of meets everybody where they are. As Kevin reflects on his first 10 years, he's already looking forward to the future with the chorus, engaging with more renowned guest artists, broadening the capabilities of the chorus, and welcoming new members to his musical family. I think most importantly right now, I am tremendously thankful and tremendously grateful. Um, uh, first of all, to the, to the symphony itself. The orchestra has been unbelievably kind to me and, and to the rest of my colleagues.